Rambo actually looks kind of fun. I might pick him up just to play him for fun. The way that you would learn how to practice this, and this is extremely important, so you, you don't give up. See how I'm not even doing the combo? Don't do the combo at first because you're gonna give up if you do that. Oh, I gotta do this video all over again. Oh, uh, I had this video done. Oh, well, okay. I just wanted to show you Southern some more information really quick because Rambo's actually pretty interesting, especially for beginner to intermediate play. He has some pretty good ideas so we talked about like leopard crawl you can basically tick off of anything and tick just means you can press a button and then go into a grab so like you do like that like that and then this i think this is his launcher you do like that and then this is one of his best moves and you can do like that, right? So what you want to do is you want to set Cetrion when she's blocking. You want to practice doing this into the grab like that. I pressed two twice. You don't have to. You can just press it once. But I pressed two twice just to make sure I confirm it. And then you want to practice this combo when you hit. So... And just make it simple at first. So the very simple combo. Decent damage, good corner carry. Easy. And then you set it to do random combo and you just practice doing, you know, if she blocks, you go into this. If it hits, you go into this. Yeah, and you just set it random combo there. That's pretty much it. And as you can see, it has good corner carry. I actually didn't know this. Well, let's show you this first. It's plus 23, so you can walk up. You don't get Oki, but you get to walk up and kind of reset neutral and get some corner position, right? But if you do this, you're actually so plus, you should be able to dash and do another one. Now, some characters will dash out of it or jump out of it. This doesn't give you Oki at all, right? But this can, depending on the character. See? And then you just keep carrying them to the corner, and then you can dominate. Once you get them in the corner, you can dominate with pretty much any button, right? Does he have any plus frames? No, why didn't they give him plus frames? That would have rounded him out. Anyway, you can kind of play a mind game with him. Um, stand one, throw. Yeah, yeah, stand, like stand one, throw, stand one, stand one into... I'm just trying to give you some ideas on what you can do when you get them in the corner. I guess stand one into... I don't know why they didn't give any mind games off of his his highs. That would have been... That would have completed him, but whatever. You could do this. Loop him forever. He's got a thro forward throw that loops for eternity. It even loops mid-screen, which is great. So that's an option. I would say the number one thing, yeah, his back door doesn't do anything. I would say the number one thing is you want to do like the kind of mind games off of this, right? Something I actually found out is if you accidentally do leopard's crawl on hit, you can actually go into this and it'll combo so you won't get punished, right? And then you can just cancel like that. And I even did, I did a old fashioned frame data test. You just set them to jump and then see if they can react if you hit. And as you can see, they can't, so it's safe. See? It's safe. So, yeah. Rambo, I mean, outside of, I guess, his anti-airs are bad, I think, or something like that. I don't know. He's got a good solid game plan. And that's pretty much it. The way that you would learn how to practice this, and this is extremely important, so you you don't give up um because i know it's hard at first first thing you want to do is you want to learn the combo break it down do this simple one it's very very simple so just practice that if you had one where you were doing like this you can do that too if you want it's just the one that i do is a little bit easier it's entirely up to you just do what what you you like for now that's pretty good too. The other thing you want to do after that is you want to set her to block, do this, and just practice going into that, and occasionally block here, right? So, just do that. 
so you can get in the habit of bl sometimes blocking after your strings because that's important too you don't want to always mix people so just practice that you can even practice dashing if you want and then finally you combine them together and you'll do this by setting random combo and break it down very very slowly so see it hit okay it hit i need to go into this okay it hit so now i need to go in this. see how i'm not even doing the combo don't do the combo at first because you're gonna give up if you do that do it five minutes a day just practice each ind individual one five minutes a day if you want to speed up this process i recommend doing it 30 minutes to an hour but again you want to baby yourself so do this i actually completed the combo on accident if she blocks it block it set your own then do that or practice just blocking do all three break it down very slowly pretty much and that's pretty much everything about Rambo. Rambo's actually pretty decent. I have Cetrion on the screen because I wanted to show you how you can actually really counter Cetrion's BS. You just need to be patient. That's pretty much how it, what it comes down to. So if Cetrion does ground pound. See, you could do that. Oh. Come on, Ops. Alright, so... Now I'm going to set Cetrion to do this. See? And then you walk in. Watch out for her teleport, though. He has a very strong anti-zoning tool, and obviously he has, he has this, too. See? And use it to get in. I really hope you play Rambo and focus on the stuff that I showed you. If you have any questions, let me know. Rambo actually looks kind of fun. I might pick him up just to play him for fun, just every once in a while, you know? I think this is his best variation by far, especially at the level that you're playing. Once you get a high level, you might use Fubar, but for now, I think that this one's the best one. I think everything else is just kind of gimmick stuff, but that's just kind of my opinion on it. But I'm sure Yodman and Big Brain God will give you better information. But anyway, I'm out. I'll see you later. Have a good night, and thanks for tolerating my ass. <laughs>